This is Chad again with Synergy Power, and I'm going to be talking about solar edge monitoring. On your solar edge inverter, which we have here, you will have an antenna that is connected to the solar edge inverter. That antenna will transmit a signal to what we call a gateway, and this is your gateway. This gateway will be installed in your home and will be connected to your router. What this gateway does is it is it gathers the signal and the data from the inverter and transmits it to this gateway and the gateway then sends it to an offline server that is hosted by Solar Edge Monitoring. On there you'll be able to get on your computer or your smartphone and monitor your Solar Edge system. So after you have turned your Solar Edge inverter on we want to make sure that we link this gateway up with your inverter. So on the solar edge gateway, you'll, you'll notice there are a series of lights. The first light is the SOK light, which is a green light. The link light is an amber orange light. And then you have your signal strength lights here. These are green lights as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to initiate a searching sequence for the gateway to look for the inverter. And what you, how you do that is this little red button here is you're going to hold that button down and you'll notice that all the lights turn on. Once they all turn on, release the button and they should flash. This should flash for about five minutes. If for some reason this does not flash for five minutes, then there's something that is interrupting the signal and we need to move the gateway closer to the inverter to establish the, 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 to establish the link. Once the link has been established, the lights will stop flashing and you'll notice that the signal lights will be lit up and the link light will flash. It'll flash and then turn off and then flash and turn off. That indicates that the gateway is linked up with the inverter. The SOK light will stay on and what that is indicating is that's indicating that it is connected to your network. Once all of those lights are on and working as described, then you will be able to see the data from the inverter on your phone or on your computer. Okay, if you have gone through the steps in linking or pairing up your gateway with your inverter and you notice that the link light is still not flashing but you have a solid SOK light and one signal bar light on. What this means is that it still has not linked up with your inverter. We recommend at this point to unplug it from your router Take the gateway as close as you can to the inverter with the power cord, plug it in, and, hold the, and, and start the search sequence again. By getting it close to the inverter, it should establish that connection and you should notice after the five minutes that the link light is now flashing. Once you've established that link, you can unplug it and take it back to your router and just simply plug it back in and it should just reestablish that link with the inverter. Once you've done that, then you should be able to see the data from the inverter on your computer or your smartphone.